it's Connor here and Jackie with another episode of the food review so a lot of you have been wondering where Jackie's been for the past mm, probably like 20 videos uh, she's been busy working I'm so back. Uh, she's back finally we finally had enough time to do a video so we decided well I decided to go to Little Caesars to try out their pretzel pretzel pizza so it's on their pretzel pretzel bread thing going on here and it has some cheddar cheese sauce mozzarella cheese a top with pepperoni and then I think some more mozzarella cheese and there's some salt on the around the crust so uh, hopefully that these will be pretty decent hopefully and it's really really greasy and I tell you truthfully it does smell kind of funky in here <laughs> so uh, I'm gonna go for it and take a bite or we could both go for it so here we go. I got some funky cheese hanging on right here. Some, so let's go for let's go for a bite. I feel as if the pepperoni is taking up all the flavor. Can't really taste anything else besides the besides the pepperoni. Yeah, I wouldn't buy it. I'm gonna try without the pepperoni. It's not that bad, but it's not good. I was expecting a whole lot more cheese flavor, but I'm gonna try another bite without the pepperoni on it. They did not put a lot of cheese on here at all. I barely got any cheese flavor. I mean, this was, how much was it? I think seven, $7. it was 760 something with tax. So it's not a, a bad price for a pizza. But it's not good. When I get it again, not really. Yeah. But I didn't really know what else to do today, so that's why I did this video. But if you have a request of what you want me to do on Wednesday, definitely leave it in the comment section below because I am definitely stumped. Anybody want the rest of this pizza? <laughs> I don't want. So I will go hold, on, hold on. Hold on. I'm not doing. All right. So now we're done eating our slices of pizza. Not the best pizza in the world, to be honest. Probably never going back to <laughs> Little Caesars ever. That's my first time I've ever gone there. So I'll let Jackie go first. Says ladies first. I'm going to give it a solid three. Actually, I'm on the same page as Jackie for once. Really? <laughs> I was going to give this a three. The only pretzel flavor, because you know it's called a pretzel <laughs> pizza. The only pretzel flavor I got was the crust on the outside they had the the butter and the salt like a regular pretzel but the middle of the crust itself really didn't give me that chewy pretzel that I wanted and the cheese wasn't even good barely even tasted it the pepperoni just overwhelmed it so this pizza is a dud and I do not recommend for you to try this unless if you like bad Nasty pizza, pizza bad pizza I really like mozzarella cheese and there was like barely I barely any. barely even tasted it, it and then like also sprinkled like and then also the smell that left in the car, it almost seems like I yeah. farted. Yeah, it smells bad. <laughs> so as always, don't forget to like, comment, share, favorite, and subscribe. For all the latest fruit reviews that come on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, every other Tuesday, and occasionally on Mondays. Mondays. And I hope to see you Wednesday on the next episode of the Food Review, and I will catch you later. Alright, Chick-fil-A time. Chick-fil-A.